Guys, do you like stew? Do you like being radical? Do you like rabbits? Well, it's time for some radical rabbit stew. Yes, radical rabbit stew. Let's play it. Let's get started. Let's check it out. Let's let the fun begin, guys. If this is your first time coming to the channel, thank you. That reminded me of Mario Brothers 3 for a second. Let's go ahead and begin. This game looked wacky. This game was something that I was like, okay, I had to sink the teeth into this. Check this out. I mean, there's a little rabbit in the bottom talking right now that you can't see. He's a, he's a cute little SOB. Look at that guy. Look at this. Home of the legendary space chefs. Famous for the delicious food. What's going on here? Little did the chefs know that the rabbit queen was jealous. Ooh. Women always gotta be causing the trouble. No, I'm just joking. One day, the rabbit queen grew tired of her tasteless vegetables. Uh-oh. Off with their heads. What's gonna go on now? And decided to abduct the space chefs. Ooh, that looks like the, the, sh the diner from Spaceballs. I will not order the special. Her minions ruthlessly crack down on a space diner. Oh no. Evil rabbits. E. Ejole. Alright, here we go, here we go. Boom, boom, boom. Let me hear you say wayo. Wayo. Alright. Oh, poor thing. Only you, the cleaning boy, managed to hide. Can you save your chef friends? Oh no. The plot begins. Alright, here we go. Look at this. It looks like a smurf. Am I Smurf? Oh my god, I am absolutely in love with the way this game looks. Look at this! Wooden spoon, a trusty old pal. What the? the oh, I'm sold. Look at this game. A button. Alright. Got him. <laughs> I did not come back into the pot. That was kind of neat. All right. Oh, wow. So it's like a really quick arcade-like video game. I, I'm digging the graphics, guys. Bad hair day, the bun lands. Here we go. Look at this. It's like a cross between a arcade and a puzzler. Wow. Okay, I could dig this. It's almost like Dig Dug Gossel. Like, you know, like in that vein, like a classic 80s arcade game. Look at that. I could definitely get behind this. Wow. This feels like something that I would have played like on the NES or something. All right, let's get in here. What's this? A stew, a big stew pot. I love that sprite right here. What's this? A chef heart, not just a quarter. Okay. <laughs> so I get a I get a new heart or what? I get more life? I get behind that. Lagomorphic intersection, the bun lands. Alright, let's do this. Alright, we're good. Go to the next one. Oh, got that one. Got him. Oh, looks like there's a coin here. What's that do? I have no idea what the coin does, but... Man, that this game is addictive, guys. I'm not even just kidding. If you grew up playing stuff in the 80s, this is something that definitely fills that vibe. This is fucking solid. Look at that. Oh, nope. I accidentally killed that rabbit. Did I fail? Okay. So you knock one off screen one time, and that's a failure. Okay, so we have to... Okay, we got that. Let's go ahead and grab this coin. So I have no idea what that does. Other than probably just 100% completion. Oh, 
Oh my gosh, that rabbit just ate me and shook his ass at me. <laughs> oh, things got difficult there. Let's, uh. I do not want to accidentally re -knock, knock that guy. Okay, look. Gonna knock him. Knock him. Knock him. Knock him. Knock him, knock him, knock him, knock him. Ah, oh, perfect, perfecto. All right, we're doing pretty good. Oh, gosh, that was awesome. Oh, I need a break. I need to get that coin. I want to get that coin. I want that coin. Come here, dude. Oh, that's gonna be hard to get that. You have to somehow get that rabbit to come at you down below. Oh, well, we'll skip that one. <laughs> we'll skip that one. All right, here we go. Okay. Oh, that was so nice. Very nice. How much? Alright. I'm already sold on this game. I'm glad I even got the chance to check it out. Wow. Okay. We're just breezing right through it. Carrot Lake. Oh, man. I could... I want some carrot cake. Come on, buddy. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna go grab this coin. Why well, have the chance? There we go. I like how he puts the shades on <laughs> after he completes the stage. Look at this, we're like on a main island now. Mud play Isle. Alright. Um. Oh my gosh, so many rabbits. So many wascally wabbits. Come here, dude. Oh my gosh, he ran. He came right for me. That was like a like a death run. He was like, yo, you're dead, 8-bit Eric. Alright, here we go. Let's check this out. Oh my gosh, is this a boss? Is this a big rabbit? Holy moly. It is. Is he farting Easter eggs out? <laughs> he's like, he's farting Easter eggs out. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, no. We're doing it, guys. He's red or pink. We got him. That wasn't too tough of a boss fight. That was actually a lot more intimidating than than I thought it would be. <laughs> All right, what's this? This is another power up. I could use some stew right now. What's this? This I'm I'm sold, guys. This is one of the best indie games I've played in a while. Silver Spoon. I get a better attack now.
I'm I'm sold on this. Silver Comet, here we go. Hold the B button. Alright. Let's hold it. Let's hold it, flip it, dip it in, ride that D double O O Y oh my. Oh dude. That's awesome. Okay, I got it now. Sold. Dunzos. Alright, let's go. <laughs> Let's do it again. Oh, look. This fat, so he's asleep. Oh, my gosh. Now that... That was a fun little solution to that. Wow. Okay, I can I can get behind that. I wonder how many stages are in this game. I think I failed. Oh, my gosh. This one's going to have a, a tougher solution. Let's do it. Okay. It's like a Snorlax. So getting all the coins is the tricky part. If you want to get like the completionist, complete, complete, like ratio rating, like a hundred percent. Oh, wow, I didn't know you could send yourself across. That changes it all. Holy cow. That changes the game right there. I didn't know you could send yourself across. All right. Did it. There wasn't even a blue coin on that one. Interesting. Looks like just one more in this area, and then it goes to the next world. Oh, nope, I failed on that one. Whoopsie. Check, please. Perfect. Nice. Carrot planes. Let's do it. What the, what the hell does the carrot do? Is that like a bomb? Oh, okay. That's kind of neat, actually. I could, I could get behind that. Wow. New mechanics introduced every couple... This is a fucking solid game. I don't care what anybody says. This is a solid game. The graphics are great. The music's great. The, the mechanics... Freaking fantastic. Um, has a lot of fun. You know, it's very arcade-like in its presentation. Look at that. This is this is probably the best indie game I've played in a long freaking time. <laughs> Whoa, look at this guy. Okay, trying to figure out. Trying to figure out what's going on. Cute little dog. Oh shoot, stuff is gonna get chaotic now. Gosh, okay. Look at this guy. I think I got him. He's dead. Wow. And I think that was the whole first world. You guys are welcome. Nah, I'm joking. 
Oh, man. I think that was a whole first world. Let's see what's going on here with the story now. Oh, look at that artwork. You single-handedly disarmed the evil Pugs Bunny. Pugs Bunny. Oh, my God. And you saved your friend, Taco the Hexapus. What the hell is a Hexapus? Is a Hectopus, Hectopus only has six, six legs? To save your other friends, you must travel to Coney Soup Bay. Look at this. This is... This is like something that would be on the Super Nintendo. To Roma and beyond. Coney Soup Bay, here we come. My god, and you know what? I'm going to end it there just in case you guys want to pursue playing this game. I'm going to say this is a must play. This is a recommendation. This is probably the most fun I've had playing a Switch Indie or an Indie in general in a long time. So Radical Rabbit Stew, get a, a must check out. Hidden Gem Territory, what do you guys think? Comment down below. Subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you guys on the next one. Have a great day and peace out.